Sarasota City Commissioners worked late tonight on a resolution to ban assault weapons, but after hours of testimony, commissioners ended up voting no. As ABC Action News reporter Cameron Pullum tells us, they were worried about getting sued. Everyone has begun to realize that common sense gun reform is needed. If you think gun laws are going to stop these people, you're sorely mistaken. Debate over gun policy filled the Sarasota Commission chambers Monday. If gun control worked, then Washington, D.C. and Chicago would be the safest cities in the nation. Orlando had a right to live. So did the 32 at Virginia Tech, the 9 after the prayer meeting last year in South Carolina. City commissioners meeting to consider a resolution calling on state and federal officials to limit the sale of assault weapons to law enforcement agencies. If you see something, say something. Well, we are seeing something, and that is an increasing number of mass shootings around the country with military-grade assault weapons. The commissioners were eager to take a stand in the name of public safety. When's the right time to do this? How can we do nothing? Until the city attorney urged caution, pointing out that passing the resolution could leave the city and the commissioners vulnerable to expensive lawsuits. In the end, commissioners voted four to one against the resolution, deciding they needed more clarification about their potential liability. In Sarasota, I'm Cameron Polam, ABC Action News.